Hello everyone, my name is Ritesh. Today I am going to show you how to plot fluorescence spectra and how can we make uh, that graph presentable for your thesis. And also I will show you how to normalize them with two different methods. One is with the software and one is with the manually thing. So let's start. First uh, you have to take uh, your data in the proper uh, format like uh, in the book you just copy and paste all of them and for plotting it it's very easy I'll, I already showed in the last video if you want you can go and check that video so you have to click uh, here or uh, like this also you can just click and drag it so it will all select like this and then you go and go to plot here at the tab and click here so it will plot like this so for like controlling it uh, uh, rescaling it you just hit control plus R so that all the plots will come within the uh, space so for this one it, this is already been uh, adjusted for according to me so for this one this is like three different spectra and uh, all of them having different intensity so this is showing the different intensity but we want to normalize so that we can show there is a shift in the wavelength so first thing this is also very important we will uh, try to beautify this one also first we'll go to normalize them so click here again and uh, which data you want to normalize just click there go to analysis mathematics you go to normalize columns and open dialog here you can do different things also if you want like here is showing input if you want input in a new uh, column then it will generate otherwise if you want uh, the same column that also you can do uh, from here where if you want new then new columns or the same column input column you can choose then the uh, normalized thing will come in the same column I want new so I'll go with the new just click OK so here this is the normalized uh, column which generate for this column similarly we'll do for this one just click analysis now this time I'll go just normalize column last use like uh, what I have done it will just create that thing same click OK again one column for this one and click here analysis normalize column click ok so these three column of all this one this one and this one and you can see here all of them having same x-axis just click x-axis this one and control drag it from here so this will be x-axis and these three will be y-axis okay and then you just go and click here line control R for rescaling so here you can see it's now uh, properly showing that there is a smooth uh, variation from black to red to green uh, instead in the last uh, spectra you can see there is we cannot like uh, by seeing we cannot see there is a shift or not so for seeing the shift we are plotting this normalized spectra first uh, this spectra will make it smooth so it's already looking proper uh, then what uh, uh, we'll do is just make it less crowded by increment is too much first we'll go for from 0 to its 14 it's okay I'll click apply so it will start from 0 and increment I want more so it will be less crowded so I'm making it 2 let's see how it look it's looking good to me so I'll go with this one and this is also looking but in last time I told you the space should be filled so we'll try to fill the space it's starting for from 400 so we'll start also from 400 and uh, there is uh, no peaks after 650 so we'll go for 650 we'll try to take the minimum be there so this is looking good to me as you can see we have maximized this area here also something if you want you can just make it at this one make it bold 
floor size 26 and this also we can go a little more 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 size if it is there that is good for uh, because uh, in the journal if it is goes we have to minimize it and then it will show so that time it won't look good you cannot see also so for this line also we can take it out so it will look good you can go to properties here none okay so there is no line now we can see this is spectra and for that legions are there similarly we'll go to we'll go to this graph first we'll try here divided by a factor is too much it is not needed so i'll go okay now it is from 0 to 1 so i have to make it 0 to 1 0 uh, to 1.1 .1. and also the increment is too much so i'll go to 0 0.25 so now it's looking good this is should be emission intensity only because actually we have to write here normalized emission intensity because it is normalized spectra here also again we will go from 400 to 700 click ok here and uh, this note is not coming like that you can just uh, one by one delete it and one by one will write it BE AE30 and AE45 so like this we can write also no and AE45 so we'll just make it a corner now it's looking beautiful this is normal spectra this is normalized spectra this one I have showed you by uh, with the software now I will show you uh, the second method in the second method this is the proper one and uh, for doing the second method I will not do some anything in this uh, workbook so we will just copy it so click on workbook this is the icon click here so it will make a copy of that same workbook so I will do the manual thing in this workbook copy of book one so what we have to do is uh, this number at 459 which is 12.55 will divide this number 12.55 to the whole column you, uh, select the column and uh, say go to set column values you can go to column h is equals to i'll show you again column h is equal to column h divided and that number 12.55 which is from this number and click apply so you can see here at the number 459 this became one as in this one also similarly we'll do in this column also we'll first see which is the highest number we can see uh, by going here and there 5.3 5 5.37 3 4 3 7 3 4 so this is the highest point at 477 at 477 5.37 so we'll go to 477 in this column where is 470 this number 5.37 control c go to set column values column f is equal to column f divided by control v apply so now this is equals to 1 and this also is equal to 1 now then another one we can check this is manual thing now this spectra is coming at highest number where first 486 486 1.72 1.71 left side it's 1.69 so 1.72 is the highest number which is 486 we'll go to 486 at this point 486 so 486 will copy this number control c go to set column values 
control B is equals to control B uh, column B sorry divide by V control V which is we have copied number apply and okay so now these three column are normalized for plotting you just click and drag it and click here control R for scaling so now it became the same spectra which we have plotted in graph 2 same spectra we got from 0 to 1 we will change it from uh, tiles and labels this it will make 0 you can see from 0 to 1 same spectra we got as we are getting from the software and also by manually so you can do anything uh, when your software is not giving proper results then you go manually also